From the launch of its first satellite in 1975 to its recent achievements in interplanetary exploration, India's space program has come a long way. Today, the Indian space sector is one of the fastest growing industries in the world, expanding at a rapid rate and providing numerous opportunities for businesses and investors. With ambitious plans to send its first astronauts to space in 2023 and the launch of its lunar exploration project scheduled for the same year, India is poised to make its mark in the international space industry. In this video, we'll explore the latest developments in the Indian space sector, from technological advancement to partnerships and collaborations, and the exciting opportunities they present for businesses and investors alike. Established in 1969, ISRO has been successful in launching numerous missions, including the Mars Orbiter mission and the Chandrayaan mission to the Moon. ISRO has promoted corporate space participation, leading to growing commercialization. ISRO has signed memorandums of understanding with many countries and international organizations for collaborative missions and technology transfer, including Microsoft for Space Technology Startups. India made history by becoming the first country in the world to reach the Martian orbit on its first attempt with the Mangalyan project. And Gaganyaan, India's first manned mission to space, is scheduled to launch in 2024. Additionally, Chandrayaan-3, India's lunar exploration project, is planned for June 2023. ISRO is developing new technologies such as reusable launch vehicles and inflatable aerodynamic decelerators. Startups like Agnikul have successfully test-fired 3D-printed rocket engines. India can offer competitive launch services to a variety of customers with the Polar Satellite Launch Vehicle and forthcoming Small Satellite Launch Vehicle. ISRO launched its largest launch vehicle Mark III, Rocket One Web India 2 mission with 36 satellites from Satish Dhawan Space Centre in Sriharikota, Andhra Pradesh. The LVM-3 will launch 36 OneWeb satellites to low Earth orbit, also known as LEO. The Indian space sector is engaging in significant programs and projects, with the unwavering backing of the country's government and the participation of business sector. As per ISRO's website, the Department of Space aims to encourage private participation in space activities to boost the space economy in India. ISRO will work alongside DOS or Department of Transportation to support this objective. To achieve this, several reforms have been proposed, including a shift from a supply-based model to a demand-based model, with New Space India Limited, or NSIL, acting as the aggregator of user requirements. The Indian space sector is engaging in significant programs and projects, with the unwavering backing of the country's government and the participation of the business sector. With a focus on cost-effectiveness, self-reliance and international cooperation, the Indian space sector is primed for expansion in the next few years paving the way for India to make an unmistakable imprint in the field of space exploration and technology. In conclusion, the Indian space sector is growing rapidly, driven by cost-effectiveness, self-reliance and international collaboration. India's space technology and infrastructure advancements have created more business and investment opportunities and startup solutions. India is poised to dominate the global space industry after the Mangalyan and Gaganyan.